Austin sanitation workers can easily get overheated, emptying cart after cart in triple digit heat. They can dump trash 800 or even a thousand times on a typical route. It's why Austin Resource Recovery doubles the number of mandatory breaks during the hottest months and provides workers with water activated cooling clothes. This is a cool vest that we provide our guys. And this right here, what you will do is just simply dip it in water, uh, cold water, and it cools the body off. But not all Texas workers have mandatory water and rest breaks on the job. And the number is expected to drop even further on September 1st. That's when a new state law takes effect that eliminates a wide range of local regulations, including an Austin ordinance that mandates water breaks for construction workers. Feel the solidarity. To protest the change, Congressman Greg Kazar is holding the thirst strike for workers' rights on the steps of the U.S. Capitol. I'm on thirst strike all day today, meaning no food, no water, and no breaks off the Capitol steps in the sun and in the in the rain to push back against Governor Abbott taking water breaks away from Texas workers in this historic heat wave. The Austin area congressman wants OSHA to establish federally mandated heat protections for workers. But we call on and push the Biden administration to solve this once and for all and put in a federal heat standard. Kassar was joined in Washington, D.C. by union leaders from Texas and across the country. Construction workers and farm workers make up a big part of the Lupa membership. We won't stand for policies that put lives in peril. National Weather Service data shows that heat kills more Americans than any other form of severe weather, including flooding, hurricanes, or extreme cold. Congressman Kassar says that's even more troubling since there's a growing likelihood that 2023 could be the hottest year on record. Betty Cross, CBS Austin News. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.